I finally decorated my wall. I'm so excited. All right, thanks for coming back to my channel. My name is Stephanie. If you're new here, I write books. That's mainly what I do. And I teach my children and I travel. Do you like my decoration on my boring gray wall? I finally got around to it. Yay me. The plan that I was gonna do this week's my videos is I was gonna focus, do specific videos regarding my books that I have for each day this week. But then I realized my mistake. Want to hear what my mistake is? My mistake is that I have horrible internet like signal right now where we're at, but on Wednesday we're moving to a better one. So stay tuned soon for more book focused videos. For now you get daily vlogs. Now, if you're wondering where I got this, it says stay positive, work hard and make it happen down here on the bottom. I got it, I believe, either at the Dollar General. Yeah, I got it at the Dollar General here in Texas. I've been wanting something to make the space behind me a little bit more interesting than a boring, boring gray beige wall. Now, why this wall? Because this is the only wall that doesn't have any noise around me. And also, I don't get interrupted by people hopping in my videos. It is my bathroom, so that's where this is at. It is Monday and it is day 12 of vlogmas day 12 of christmas christmas is in less than two weeks i'm excited got all my presents bought and sorted i will be wrapping them this coming weekend most likely but what is on the agenda for today now normally we'd be doing schoolwork right now but i decided we're gonna take a little bit of break for the rest of the school year from our sit down lessons and just let the kids enjoy the rest of december and get back to the hard grind of schoolwork in January. I'm also hoping I can make a dent in my work in progress also. But what do I have planned for myself today? Well, husband is not around because I sent him away to do laundry because the campground we're at, the laundry mat was broken, but they fixed it and now he's done, he's doing the laundry, like two weeks worth of laundry. So that means I have time to sit and work on my project and work on my plan for the next quarter and yeah, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to eat some top ramen because that's the healthiest meal I can think of right now. Haha, <laughs> I'm kidding. It's not very healthy, but it's what I feel like having. It's a little chilly here for Texas, but still not snowing like it is back in Oregon where we're from. So I'm not complaining, merely commentating on the state of the weather today. <sighs> for a little bit later on today, after I work on my goals, I'm going to make sure the kids have lunch. And then I'm going to see about writing my story. That's what I'm doing so far. I hope to have that for you guys in some video format. So what happens when you make top ramen and put on a low boil, you go and walk away to do some videotaping for your vlog? I'll show you what happens. It gets slightly burned on the bottom. It's a little crispy. It did not get burnt to the pan, so it's okay. Right? You're right? Yeah, it's okay. Right, guys? You want some of my burnt top ramen? No. Yes, please. It's still top ramen. <laughs> so after I had my top ramen, which wasn't that bad, and it cleaned out the pan well, um, let's see, I did the dishes, made the kids their own top ramen, which they're enjoying their top ramen now. It's now 4 o'clock. We got a late start to the day. Which meant we got a late start to breakfast, a late start to lunch, so we'll probably have a late dinner. I'm not going to start dinner until my husband gets home and after we put away the laundry. Because I don't have to stop making dinner in the middle of it all. So, the funny story is, so the laundromat at the camp we're at has been broken. But then they said, well, you figured out it was one washer, so they opened it up. Well, I called my husband to say something to him. I forget what I was saying to him. That's not the point. The point is, I talked to him, and he said that the um, laundry room flooded, and they figured out where the flooding was coming from. It is the draining from one of the washing machines. Luckily, um, the clothes are in the dryer now, and they should be here with, you know, folded clothes, because um, when he does laundry at the laundromat, I only ask that he the laundry is folded. A lot of times one of the kids would go with him, but lately the kids have been doing schoolwork while he does laundry or they just stay home. And today they stayed home. 
So it's four o'clock, like I said. Um, the kids are having a late, late, late lunch or an early dinner. One of the two. I'm not sure what to call it yet. Uh, it's just one of those Mondays, I guess. I think um, I will. I will be working on my book. I need to figure out what the heck direction I'm going to go. I can't decide if I'm going to pants the crap out of it, which isn't really pansing if you know the the characters that you're going to have for the love interest. I don't know. And I really wish we had better internet signals so then I can post my stuff on like Instagram and social other social media places. But it takes forever and a day. Like uh, I had a post that had or a, a reel that I did on Instagram. It was a purple background with all the different books and like some small bullet points about what the plot was for each of the books. And then it had a buy link on, her, on there and it took like 12 hours to upload. So it's annoying. Very, very annoying. I thought about videotaping some more content for the video but I just got done editing some of it and it's a bit longer of a video which means it's gonna take three times as long to upload to YouTube <laughs> but children what are you doing I'm trying, I'm trying to stay quiet <laughs> <laughs> they fail so stay tuned for a little blooper of an introduction and uh, I'll see you in tomorrow's video bye And I travel a bit. <coughs> I also homeschool my children. But if you are watching this in December, most likely this is one of the. I don't even know what I'm going to say. This is dumb.